Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how we can multiply 25 with 25 using the abacus. Okay, so as with any standard procedure for a two digit number multiplied by two digit number, we'll start with the fourth rod on the abacus. Okay, so this is our fourth rod. Units place, tens place, hundreds place and thousands place. So, we'll start with the tens place digit of the first 25, multiply it with the tens place digit of the other 25. So, it will be 2 multiplied by 2 and 2 multiplied by 2, the answer we have to take it as 0, 4. Any one digit number multiplied by with a uh, table, the answer should always be considered as a two digit answer. We have seen this rule in the right from the starting multiplication methods. Okay, so 2 multiplied by 2 will be taken as 0, 4 from the fourth rod. So 0 on the fourth rod, 4 on the third rod. Then we'll move one place to the right, that is on the third rod, and then multiply the tens place 2 of the first number with the units place 5 of the other number. So it will be 2 multiplied by 5, which is 10. So we'll add 10 from the third rod. So we'll have to add 1 on this rod and 0 on the other. So nothing to be done here. Now we'll remain on the same third rod and start with the units place uh, 5 of the first number multiplied with the tens place 2 of the other number. So 5 multiplied by 2 is 10. So we'll take 10 on this third rod. So again 1 here and 0 on the next rod. For the final step we'll move one step to the right and come to the uh, second rod. Now we'll multiply the units place 5 of the first number with the units place 5 of the other number. So 5 multiplied by 5 is 25. So we'll take 25 from this rod. That is the second rod. So 20 and 5. And the final answer that we have for 25 multiplied by 25 is 625. Okay. So this uh, 25 multiplied by 25 procedure is done. Now we'll go to the next one which is 19 multiplied by 19. So for that again we will start from the 4th rod, we will uh, also start from the 10th place digit of the first number multiplied with the 10th place digit of the second number. So 1 multiplied by 1 here will be taken as 0 1, not just 1, it will be taken as 0 1. So 0 on the 4th rod and 1 on the 3rd rod. Then we will move to the 3rd rod, multiply the 10th place 1 with the units place 9 of the other number. So 1 multiplied by 9 will be taken as 0, 9. Okay, so 0 on this rod, 9 on the next rod. Now we'll continue on the third rod itself. Then consider the units place 9 of the first number multiplied with the tens place 1 of the other number. So 9 multiplied by 1 will be 0, 9 again. So 0 on this rod, 9 on, to be added on this rod. So for addition of 9 here, I'll use the big friend formula which is minus 1 plus 10 okay and for the final step we'll move to the third rod uh, sorry second rod now and the final step is units place 9 of the first number multiplied with the units place 9 of the other number so 9 nines are 81 so 81 will have to be added from this second rod to add 8 on this rod i'll use the big friend formula which is minus 2 plus 10 and 1 on the first rod that is units place so the final answer that we have for 19 multiplied by 19 is 361. So I hope the procedures for both these multiplications that is 25 multiplied by 25 and 19 multiplied by 19 is well understood by everyone. Uh, in case of any difficulties, please mention it in the comments. I'll try and address it in an upcoming video. Thank you.